Here we have been given a line segment AB and a point E external to it and we need to find a line segment through E which is parallel to AB. Now drawing a parallel line is pretty much like taking a U-turn because when you take a U-turn you end up going parallel to your original direction. And how do we take a U-turn? Well one can think of it as taking two 90 degree turns in the same direction. So suppose you are going in this direction, then you take a right turn and then again another right turn, you end up going parallel to your original direction. Some people call it anti-parallel, but here we are not really concerned with the sense, whether we are going to the left or towards right doesn't matter. So that's a concept we will use here. So what is the meaning of taking a 90 degree turn? That is like drawing a perpendicular. So in other words, we'll be drawing a perpendicular to AB through E and then we'll be drawing perpendicular to that perpendicular through E so that we will get a line parallel to AB. Now we have already seen how to draw a perpendicular to a given segment from a given external point. So let's do that construction. If needed, you can revise it from here. So here we have this perpendicular from E to AB. Let us extend it to some arbitrary point, say Q. So now E becomes an internal point of this line segment, say QP. And then we'll be drawing a perpendicular to this line QP through the internal point E. Uh, this construction also we have seen. If you want to revise it, you can click here. So FG is perpendicular to QP and QP is perpendicular to AB. So therefore, FG is par parallel to AB as required and it also passes through E as we wanted. So that's a construction.